Hi, I'm Genevieve Gorder. I'm a designer, but I love to cook. And I also have a seven-year-old who loves to eat, but not always the same stuff that I love to cook. So I'm gonna do pad thai two ways that won't take you any longer. It's like making one dish. So pad thai, typically I like shrimp, but because we're dealing with kids' tastes as well, chicken is a really safe bet. We go to the rice noodle. You can get the vermicelli, you can get the typical pad thai noodles. It doesn't really matter. Limes, peanuts, garlic. Huge heavy hitters in this dish. Spring onions, cucumber is my special little kick in that I pickle and add a little vinegar to to give that sour finish. Bean sprouts, cilantro, shallots, two eggs, and then we have the most important spot of all, and this is where we make the sauce. So we've got sriracha, who we all know and love. We have the fish sauce, tamarind paste, rice vinegar, some sugar. I add a little soy to my pad thai, and kids, let's just face it, they love soy sauce. And of course your canola oil that you just liberally grease the wok with. That extra guy in the sauce, our good friend the lime. So, let's get started. Behind me in the wok, I've cooked the chicken, the garlic and the shallots have cooked with that, and then I've mixed the noodles in after parboiling them on the side. Now we're gonna make the most important part of this dish, and that's the sauce. Put three tablespoons of the palm sugar, about the same amount of fish sauce. The limes are the true kick, though. You want another three tablespoons. Stir it up a little bit. I take my sauce, I basically pour it right onto the mixture. And with tongs, you mix it all together. Okay, now for kids, this dish is done. Give them some recognizable things like chicken. Take out the shallot if you have that kid. They won't know what's in there, but they'll taste the richness of this dish and learn to love it. So if I leave the stuff that mom's putting on her pad thai, all of a sudden it starts to look a little bit yummier to a kid. So I'm layering on some chopped peanuts now, cilantro is very controversial. You either love it or you hate it. I love it. Some green onions. I do an extra bit of lime because you can never have too much. A tiny bit of sriracha, but not too much because if it's too much, it kind of overpowers everything else. Your bean sprouts, I like them fresh and cold on top. I don't like to mix them in hot. I like the crunch better. And one of my favorite little tricks, some crispy onions. For my family, we always have pickled cucumbers on top, and you are fini. You look like an amazing chef, and all you've done is layered condiments. So there we go. One meal, two ways, and you saved a ton of time, and you made everybody happy.